hello friends so welcome back to my youtube channel so in this video i am going to show you how you can fix 1034 index for table db is correct to corrupt try to repair it error in jamp php my admin basically you can see when basically when you try to click on user account on when you try to go to user account tab in my sql php my admin so you will see or you can see the error in 1034 index for table db or table user is correct try to repair it this error so i will show you how you can fix this error the table might be db or it might be user table okay so error might be index for table db is correct or index for table user is correct correct okay so basically if you try to search this error in stack overflow you can see the error is how to repair correct correct to table in jamp php my admin so if you scroll down and if you try to see the solution you can say uh, basically if any of the table in your php my admin is corrupt so you have to repair it okay as the message is saying try to repair it so you have to repair that table that's it so it's very simple you have to repair the table you have to run the query for repairing the table so here you can say run the following query to uh, repair damaged table so repair table user that's it what is the query repair table and table name so in our case if error is try to repair the table db index for table db is correct means the db table is correct so you will run the query repair table db if the error is index for table user is correct so you will run the query repair table user that's it it's very simple if you try to run this error and if you open again user accounts you will see the error has gone so basically you have to go to sql type and just run the command in my case db table is correct so i will run the command repair table db that's it and if i click on go if i execute this table execute the query the error will gone so in my case i have already fixed the error so i faced the error so i thought ki i should make the video on this so if you are facing this error so just run this query and the error will gone and you can easily fix the error okay so if now uh, i click on user accounts so if you click on user accounts so now you can say there is no error error has gone so that's it it's very simple you have to run the query which is repair table and table name that's it so if you like the video if you have fixed the error so like the video and comment the video and if you are new to my youtube channel you may subscribe my youtube channel for more videos like this thank you